Let's hold conversations here. Ah, why did you do that? Who was mad? Was something going on? I can still type here, I can still type here, I can still type here. Mod Weed Lord. Mod VMPS 2 Packs Mod Lyrac. Mod Nambona. Thank you. So I'm I'm really confused. It like I there's something about this that just hurts me so deeply inside that I can't get over it. Right? He makes the nexus. I kill a bunch of probes here, right? I'm up 3 workers. That's pretty big here. He's supply blocked. He's making goons off of this fucking nexus or off of two gates like Look at how quick this Reaver comes out. Like, look at this. Look at this. What do I have? I have my command center that went up. I have two siege tanks, and he has a Reaver and a shuttle coming over. I have two fucking siege tanks. A second factory. Just finished. You have to bring the SCVs with the push guy in the chat or you don't kill the Nexus. You literally can't do it with Marines. It just, it fucking, they'll kill it with just the Zealots. The first two Zealots they make will hold the rush. But this is absurd. Like... I don't have siege mode yet. I don't have an eBay yet. And he went to fucking gate. So I was like, well, it's not that quick of a robo. So I guess we can slow down the eBay a little bit. But no, you re like this is insane that they can get away with fucking everything in the whole world. Oh, guys, you're so stupid. People trying to point out that I have SCVs in the rush. You, you, the amount that you are out in left field and unrecoverable is significant. It is significant. But this is fucking crazy to me. It's just like I'm fucked now. I thought I had this aspect fucking solved. Where if they have two gate, if they don't have two gate, I go eBay after tank. And if they have two gate, then I can go eBay after second factory. But he stopped on four goons. He made only four goons. That's it. And just skipped everything else. In the chat. Um, like, I actually, I figured this out. That if they go two gate, that uh, you can go second factory. I actually, in one of my casts, I talk about it. It was um, YSC versus Sharp from G uh, ASL last season, I believe, where Sharp busted a Nexus, but it was a one-gate Nexus, and I was like, you have to make an eBay after one tank here uh, while expanding to stop the Reaver, right? And Sharp didn't do it, and he ended up losing to YSC. Uh, because this is something that I, like, I've lost so many games against Nexus first that I've finally figured out, like, these little decision trees that you can take. So he had two gates. So I was like, all right. Because you don't have the money to make units off two gates and go reaver that quickly, which is why my eBay was late. So what he did was he only made four goons, but there's no way for me to check that. So now I'm losing confidence, right? I'm losing a fucking ton of confidence in the matchup because this guy did this thing that fucking doesn't truly make sense. It's not that quick of a reaver, but it's extremely quick based on what he actually opened up with. Where if I think that he might be doing this, I can just make the turrets in time easily. And then it's like, okay, you don't have any units either. Like, it's this type of situation. This is, like, very painful as a player to have to go through. Oh, wow, he just he did this. The thing is, Terran doesn't have anything like this where we can be doing one build and then just switch it. I can't go fucking... Two factory, make two siege tanks, and then go starport immediately and go into siege tank drop. 
or whatever the fuck. You can't do that. It does that doesn't exist because you'll just die. Whereas for Protoss, it's like, yeah, I don't know, I won because I did that. <laughs> that will literally never happen as Terran. 